Hello and welcome back to WMWD. Today we have a really exciting topic and very important about data security and uh, protecting your privacy. Last time we spoke about the program Recover, here on the right side, to restore files or whole hard drives. And uh, today my question is, would you know how to erase securely USB sticks, hard drives or SD cards before you sell it to somebody else on eBay or give it to a friend? To show you the difference between the normal delaying with, for example, string delayed in Windows and the securely erasing of data with, for example, the tool eraser, uh, we prepared here this little book from John where he uh, did exercises in math. And the book consists of just normal pages full of data and at the beginning a table of content. What happens if you delete something in Windows with, for example, a string plus delayed? Uh, Windows has also a table of content and it just delays the entry. For example, from page number 13, all the data are not connected anymore. So if I go to page 13, the data itself are still there. So, and you could recover them, for example, with a tool like Recover. What Eraser does is instead, it overwrite the data with one and zeros and not just deleting them. And there are different methods. You can overwrite once, three times, seven times, and even 35. We will show this later. And we do the same. We can, you can imagine you can still see a little bit the data. So we do it a second time here to make sure nobody can get our data. So you can download uh, the installation file and the link in the description. I will just show it uh, fast. It's quite easy. We have just to follow the instructions. So and then I press run eraser. So at the first uh, time you should uh, uh, specify the method. Uh, it's the Goodman 35 passes. It takes uh, quite a long. Uh, I will put it to the German one, seven passes, and uh, leave it like this. All right, let's show it now on the PC. I prepared here a USB stick with some data. These are our uh, private data from the last video from Recover. Uh, some family pictures and videos from John playing Fortnite. So, and two doc files Top Secret 1 and Top Secret 2. So, um, let's say we deleted this private data uh, in the past by pressing string plus delete and it says. Yes, are you sure? Permanently. And we long forget uh, that we, there were some data and we deleted them in this way. Now we have still two files and we want to sell um, the USB to, some, uh, to another person on eBay or we want to give it away to a friend, but we know he or she is very curious. So we want uh, to safely delay the fi uh, files. So I do it in two ways. Uh, with a doc file 1, I go on the right mouse button, eraser, erase. So it asks me if I'm really sure to erase the selected items. I say yes. It takes a few seconds and the file is gone. So I will show you the second way uh, with a task in eraser. So we start the program. So we go to Erase Schedule, 
it opens here one and I uh, right mouse button new task so then it asks me um, for a name I can give it but I can also leave it out and, and when it should start I say immediately and now it asks me for the data to delete this one I just want to delete a file you can also folder recyclable unused space or a whole drive or part partition and also for the method um, I use again here the German one seven passes and I browse for my file so I use this one here and open okay okay and because I said immediately it starts immediately and it, the file is gone that's the second method so now the big moment uh, has come we want to sell our USB to another person and we think it's empty so um, I test with Recover if it's really empty uh, we I will leave here on this uh, on the right side a link to our video about Recuva. so we say all all files and the uh, J and I leave out for a moment the deep scan and start and what you can see is that our private data what we are for already forgot are still there because we didn't delete it in the safe mode with eraser so i i can say here uh, recover for example on the desktop a new folder it takes a few seconds and our private data with all the bank data and so on are still there so what about the other two files i will repeat the same now with a deep scan I will start to recover again. Say all files. Say J. Browse and deep scan and start. And I will just uh, leave it for a while and we'll come back about in 15 10 minutes to see if it found anything else. So that took about 10 minutes now. So and. Um, if I check um, the list of files I could recover, there are only this private data. Some old me uh, videos are excellent, but no chance to get back our Word files. They are overwritten and that was our aim. So what should you do if you want to sell uh, this hard drive or this USB stick to another person it seems to be empty uh, you start a razor uh, you put a new task um, I will say uh, manually then add my data and this time not a file uh, I use a drive parti partition and then very important use the right hard disk or drive you, if you choose your main drive with Windows, you will overwrite everything and you can't get it back. So be sure you choose the right one. Here is J. And then the method, we spoke about it. I think Gutman is uh, 35 plus is exaggerating um, and it takes ages. So I will choose uh, here from, from the Air Force three passes. That's enough for me. That's all. So I press OK so that's in my queue and I can say right mouse button run now so and it takes I think uh, half an hour something like this to overwrite any data on the USB and then you can be sure you can sell it to another person and there are no private data anymore at the end of the video some uh, last hints um, when you restart the PC and um, you erased everything it might be you can't uh, get access anymore to the USB you have to make a uh, to format it a quick a quick one uh, that just takes a few seconds then you can use USB again that's one point the, and the other point is um, I recorded everything on a second account of my PC the English one 
and even though it's administration rights, um, it was not possible to do this task, uh, what I showed you with a, um, with a drive for whole partition. It always crashed. I tried different uh, versions of Eraser. Um, so I switched to my main account and uh, also tried the main account on another PC. Everything worked fine. So just in case you have also different accounts, just use the main one. Yeah, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. And as usual, we are curious how you handle this kind of stuff on your PC. Just leave a comment down below the video and you know, we would be pleased to welcome you back on our channel.